On a rather shaky ground, the lawmakers started the 8th Assembly. The weeks before the resumption brought with it controversy over the leadership of the two chambers. The mock elections conducted by the leadership of the ruling APC perhaps did not help the situation. Instead of the members to agree, the process further found the ember of discord amongst them. And when the D-Day came, the party got what it perhaps did not bargain for. As some lawmakers were waiting to meet with the president on the leadership crisis, 57 senators present at the upper chamber unanimously voted Senator Saraki as a Senate president. Protect, protect, and defend the constitution of the federal government of Nigeria. And defend the constitution of the federal government of Nigeria. So help me God. So help me God. Hours after, Honorable Yakubu Dogara emerged the Speaker of the House, this outcome did not sit well with some leaders of the party. And since then, the National Assembly has seen little peace. The tussle over the leadership has largely unsettled the legislature, announcing the names of principal officers Tom Valen. <laughs> since then, the National Assembly has gone on recess. Few days to resumption, the date was moved by a week. In all of these, there was huge disagreement on who gets what. The party holds its ground, but from the letter by the Speaker to the Chairman of the APC, there is no agreement. Honorable Dogara insists the southwest and northeast zones should not produce the leader and chief whip of the House, as they already have a Speaker and a Deputy Speaker. But as the lawmakers plan to reconvene on Tuesday, many issues are on the table. First will be how they hope to arrive at a common ground on electing principal officers amicably, considering the chaotic outcome before they went on recess. The same note now poses some very critical questions. How will the House come to an agreement considering the lawsuits by some members aimed at stopping the announcement? How will the National Assembly react to the police investigation into the allegations of forgery of the standing rules? How uh, will the lawmakers address some other task ahead of the National Assembly, like the appointments of service chiefs? As the lawmakers resume their duties, another recess may be in the bag, a factor that may generate more concerns from Nigerians. But presently, what will be paramount is how the lawmakers will resolve their issues in order to face the legislative business fast. Shion Wakimbale, reporting for Channels Television News.